Welcome fellow folders to a brand new video and today we have another unboxing of a mysterious origami model that was sent to my PO box. Um, I was told I had the package uh, coming a few weeks ago and it's finally arrived. Now I'm so excited to see what is in this. If you ever want to send me any models or pieces, whatever type of origami, my PO Box address is on the screen, as always in the description. Make sure to send in something if you want to um, and get a personal video unboxing of what you sent. So it's quite cool. We have one origami model all the way from Canada. This is crazy. I'm just this moment is always so special to me because I have no clue what I am receiving and it is so unreal that someone has made something that is inside here that has taken the time and the passion to put so much love into what they have made to then decide that they want to send it to me and of course wrap it all up and go through that process so it means so much before even opening the parcel that I appreciate whoever sent this and whoever sends me things in the past and the future. Um, it means so much that they that they went ahead and done this. It is such a kind gesture and I am so grateful for everything that I receive um, from this point in the past and the future of course. It is a very very special moment for me and I want to keep thanking I want to keep thanking whoever sent this and of course everyone else that has or about to. So thank you very much and I will keep thanking you throughout this video. So let's jump straight into it. So we have this small little package and of course I have had any possible information from the sender. Of course I can show mine, this is my PO box address as I have just stated and then they have said one origami models. So let's decide where to cut. Now I did wrap um, extra tape around this for the paper. I think I'll just yeah, cut here. Cutting my own tape. I've started that. Then I can open it up, so I think that is a good idea. I'll cut it quite low so this part of the tape still sticks on. If I can manage that. Okay, 
very close to what's in there, so let's try and push it down slightly. I think I'll just tear from here, just in case. Yeah, we don't need these anymore. I don't want to risk cutting anything I'm not supposed to cut. Okay, so now we have enough access. I'm going to quickly look inside just to make sure there is no other information the, the sender has attached, just in case I review it. And if I do, of course, it will be edited out. So, no, there's a note in there, but there it is, and it's at the bottom. So, let's see what we have. Let's grab this first one. What do we have here? Oh! <laughs> I'm guessing that is, uh, I, was, I was going to say Robert Lang's there, Satoshi Kimiya's tree frog, and this is so cool. And again, it's an unreal feeling that someone has made this and sent it to me. It's, it's crazy that this is someone else's fault now in my possession, and it's so cool. Look at that. It's very well folded as well. The eyes look puffed even though they're not stuffed, they look puffed from the way they did it. They have a nice posture on the legs, they've even attempted to add a little sort of back creases on top which again is a really nice touch. So that's very cool. And also, this is one of the models that, if you don't already know, I don't like repeating models, but for Kamiya's tree frog, um, this is the fold that I have seen the most incredible renditions with the colours of paper. Every fold that I've seen suits the colour and this was this would be the model that I would fold countless times over and over. I just love every rendition that I see of this. So thank you so much. It's impeccable. Again, I love how the little sticky toes are pulled out and spread out. So Brian, thank you very much, that is the number one. So I think we have more than one model in here. Next we have, what do we have? Oh, is this the um, Jeremy Schaefer's folding, self-folding sheet but turned into a crane? That is a very cool. Now I have this model upstairs but not um, collapsed like this. How would it be on like that? That's so cool. Again, this is quite a tricky model to get right, especially this size because you have all these very sleek um, need to be accurate creases in order to fully reverse all the colours to get these uh, great colour changes. So folder of this has done exceptionally well. Um, it's very cool. Look at that. A self folding crane. I bet the folder didn't even fold this. It done it itself. He or she just put a piece of paper on the table and before you know it there has been a crane that has folded itself. But very cool. Thank you so much for that. Next what do we have here? Something green. Now, I'm going to guess this is a dragon, but I do not recognise this dragon. So please let me know what this one is. Though it may say in the note, which I'll read at the end, but it's a very cool dragon. Very nice. I've never seen this model before. I'm not sure who it's by. I believe this is Kami paper as well. And this one, I'm not sure what this paper is. It looks painted. It feels painted. It's got that nice, smooth, rough feeling I think it is. It looks it. Though it could be completely wrong. Thank you so much, the dragon is very cool, especially the little colour change at the jaw. What do we have next? We've got quite a few in here actually. So we have... What is this? This is, but it is very cool. Some sort of bird. What's that called again with all the, the cool colours?
colourful feathers, I forgot what that's called. I'm guessing it's that. Though I cannot, for the life of me, remember the name of what that's called. That'll come to me. That will come to me. But I'm guessing that's what it is. But that's a very cool fold. So thank you so much for that. I'm going to have fun taking all these pictures. Next, oh, what do we have here? Another little bird of some sort. I'm not sure what. This is so cool. I'm not sure of the design or who designed it. But it's just this overwhelming feeling of joy that someone else made all these. And I'm going to keep saying it because it's I'm full of passion and love and respect for the folder that did this. It's just crazy that they are in my possession and I need to look after them, which I will. So yeah, I'm not sure who this is by, but again, it's a very nice fold. And I love the, 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 the slumness of each part. Next. So this is the last one, and it feels a big one. So let's see what we have. Oh, we have Robert Lang's Rose Belt. Elk, I've said that completely wrong, I know I have, but yep, that's what we have. Why did you send me this? This is a such a, a crazy model to make. So thank you so much. Um, I think, did I give this away in a, a, a recent giveaway a while ago? I can't remember if I gave this away, I need to look to see if I still have it. But the chances of if I did give it away to have one back is crazy. Again, I feel this is painted paper, so thank you so much, yeah, I'm guessing it is, so uh, this is crazy. I was not expecting such a complex fold to be received like this. Um, this model is, is it circle packed and then you need to do the crazy pre-creasing and then the collapsing to make it, but it's crazy and you did a, a really good job as well. So you should be very proud, very proud of yourself for this. This is so cool. Wow. Right, thank you so much. And then I'm going to have a read this letter. Oh, I'll just double check the package. So there's nothing left in the package. So how, how cool is that? It arrives like this. That is crazy. So I'm just going to quickly open it up to make sure there's no email addresses um, in case there's any information that I can't show. So I tried to open it up but it seems to be a little puzzle a letter which is actually really cool. So this end up letter. Hi Grant, I've seen all the wonderful things people have sent you and I wanted to give you something as well. Oh, petal fold. Petal fold this flat. Okay. What? Oh, we have the models. So I'll go over them in a second. So I'm going to fail this so bad. Let's take this. Petal fold this flat. organic models, some of which are designed by me. Reverse fold here. This is, this is so cool! I can't go over the excitement of this. But first of all, let's read the models. So we have the models, the name and the designer. We have the Roosevelt Elk. That was a, what did I say? Rose Elk? Anyway, Roosevelt Elk by Robert Lang, which is this beautiful piece right here. The Tree Frog, also by Robert Lang. This one right here. The Crane with Hands, that's what it's called, by Jeremy Schaefer, which is right here. 
the traditional dragon that's uh, his design or her design so I'm gonna get to this one right here that's the it's a peacock I forgot the name of it I couldn't remember but thank you so much so the traditional dragon which is their design the ostrich that's what it is it looked familiar I couldn't figure out what it was called or the name but it is an ostrich so thank you so much and the peacock so that is actually a very cool design and it is very impressive that you managed to do this from what looks to be a small square so thank you so much your designs are exceptionally well and you can design better than me I cannot design to save myself so thank you so much that's so cool let's pop that there I love this little pouch so there's nothing more inside here put that to the side so in here you'll find some of models, some of which are designed by me. Reverse fold. I believe it's not that as a wait, I'm gonna run after it put the wrong. Or am I? Is that right? I'm doing that right. This, this, this is a complex puzzle I cannot figure out. Oh, is that right? So reverse fold. I hope you enjoy them. Reverse fold right flap along the crease. I'm sorry, again, I need to do both. I think that would make sense. Okay, and then reverse fold this one. And then, both got to this part. I've had the wonderful privilege of folding the region 3.5 thanks to you. Thank you so much, um, you are so welcome. I would love to see your fold. I would love to share it everywhere. Please show me when you get the chance. Turn the mod over. Okay, and then reverse fold it. I hope you enjoy them. Reverse fold right flap along the crease. Oh, from Cameron. Cameron, thank you so much. This is this is the nicest thing someone has ever made me. This is such a cool idea. I cannot find the words to express how happy I am to see something so amazing like this. This is incredibly well put together. It is a very, very, very smart idea, Cameron. This is insane, you should be very proud of yourself. Um, thank you so much for taking your time to make all these beautiful models. Thank you so much for um, putting it all together to send to me. Um, I'm not sure what age you are, but if you are younger, uh, please thank your parents for helping put all this together. Um, thank you so much Cameron, and I would love to see your reunion fold. This is such a cool thing, this is, I am so amazed that you managed to put something like this together and it's a puzzle that I almost failed as you could have seen and it took me a few tries to get it but I finally managed to do it. This is crazy. It's like a little complex puzzle with a, such a rewarding experience. Um, so I would love to know how, how you came up with this idea, Cameron, that was insanely smart um, and you should be very 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 proud of yourself for doing all of this and I cannot thank you enough for the time that you took to do all of this and then send it to me. Cameron, 
thank you so much. If you have any Instagram pages or Facebook, please let me know. I would love to share your work. I would love to share your passion, your love for origami. So if you can, please let me know and I would love to be in touch with you. So thank you so much, Cameron. Thank you for everything that you have done. Thank you a million times. I cannot thank you enough for doing this for me. This is such a kind gesture and you are an amazing person. I want you to keep folding. I want you to keep practicing. I don't want you to give up, never give up. Keep pushing forward and you will enjoy origami so much more. Thank you so much, Cameron. Um, you are an amazing person and now an amazing friend. So thank you so much Cameron and everyone else thank you for watching this video I hope you enjoyed it please leave a like subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you all in the next video now to get pictures of, of all this beautiful artwork